I'm Patrick O'Neill, and along with my co-authors, I thank you for watching this video abstract for our paper, Robustness of Energy Landscape Controllers for Spin Rings Under Coherent Excitation Transport. Our goal in this paper is to investigate whether the fundamental limitations on performance and robustness from classical feedback control carry over to quantum systems, particularly for state transfer and spin rings. Or is there some manner to work around that performance robustness trade-off? As our departure point, we consider the fundamental limitations from classical feedback control, which relate the performance of a tracking control problem characterized by S, or the sensitivity transfer function, with the logarithmic sensitivity, inverse to the robustness and characterized by T, or the complementary sensitivity transfer function. As the identity S plus T is equal to I reveals, we can't have the best of both worlds. The better the performance, the more the robustness suffers. In terms of the quantum dynamics, we consider the solution to the coherent state transfer problem generated by a nominal Hamiltonian with either coupling field or control errors. These uncertainties are encoded by the structure matrix S and modulated by a scalar strength C. For our performance metric, we parallel the classical control tra tracking paradigm and consider a type of tracking error, the fidelity error. As for our robustness metric, and in keeping with the classical tracking control problem, we use the logarithmic sensitivity, basically the differential sensitivity of the fidelity error to the given uncertainty, normalized by the nominal fidelity error and the nominal value of the uncertain parameter. In terms of results, well, overall, we observe that the classical trade-off between robustness and performance that is required by classical control is seen. For example, in this case, indicative of the majority of test cases, we clearly see a negative correlation between the fidelity error and the log sensitivity, showing that as the performance is degraded, the log sensitivity falls off or robustness increases. This is a classical result in what we would expect from a classical system. However, in this case, for a six ring undergoing localization, in other words, we're keeping the spin at the initial state, we see the opposite trend, where as the performance is degraded, the robustness is also degraded. This indicates that the best performing controllers are also the most robust, which is a very non-conventional result. Coming back to the original question, we do see that in some cases, coherent state transfer and spin rings provides the conditions to get around that trade-off between performance and robustness that is a fundamental limitation from classical feedback control. Though the reason for this non-conventional trend is still an open question and a topic of ongoing research. Thank you for your time, and we hope that you enjoy the paper.